My name is Virginia Vinscoop of Gays Against Guns and Rise and Resist. Yes, we are politicizing these deaths. We are politicizing, as we always do, the utter preventability of the deaths in El Paso uh, and Dayton, Ohio. We are also politicizing the mass murder in El Paso because the message that shooter was sending comes from the very top. And that message is white supremacy. From Mexicans are rapists and criminals. Infestation, invasion, shithole countries, and fine people on both sides when a neo-Nazi ran over a peaceful protester. More and more lost young men are taking up arms against fellow human beings because their president tells them they are the enemy. And even as he incites the stunted, the violent, the aggrieved, he and the Republican-led Senate, who refuse to pass gun control legislation that 90% of the country wants, they do not represent us. The president characterized the El Paso shooting as, quote, acts of cowardice. Not racism, not xenophobia, not twisted murderous hate, not wrong, and certainly not domestic terrorism, which is what it is. He cannot call those deaths that because he is complicit. And so are the Republicans who stand by and let him endanger immigrants, people of color, women, people with disabilities, LGBTQ. LGBTQ people and poor people. He endangers them with his cruel policies, his divisive and hateful rhetoric, and he endangers them by not passing any gun laws that would protect the 40,000 people from dying from a gun every day in this country. In the, every year. It is political. We have seen politicians address uh, mass slaughter with action most recently in New Zealand, where assault weapons were promptly banned after a white supremacist attack to mosques. There are not fine people on both sides. The side that worships the Second Amendment and blocks gun laws is the same side that dehumanizes refugee and asylum seekers. It's the side that strips rights from queer people, takes away women's reproductive autonomy, ignores climate change, and refuses to protect our election from Russian meddling. Right. So my ask to everyone today here is to get involved. Whether it's doing direct action with Gays Against Guns or Rise and Resist or another organization, work for a candidate, pick an issue, do something. It is so easy to fall into despair, but it's so much better to join together with other angry, determined, good people to make the country better. Do something. Thank you.